So yes, of course, there is a connection between emotional stress, health, and DNA. And that's something that Dr. Elizabeth Blackburn, Nobel-winning molecular biologist, has been studying for years and years. In particular, she's an expert on telomeres. They are the little endpoints of the chromosomes on our DNA. And I explain that in my book. So the important thing here to understand is that short telomeres, short little endpoints on the chromosomes are associated with, there seems to be a link with that, with heart disease, diabetes, cancers, other diseases, and to chronic stress, to PTSD, post-traumatic stress disorder. Now what's exciting and very interesting to me is here, I'm gonna give you a radical idea. If I was an insurance company, I'd start connecting the dots. I'd say, okay, here's a test now that Dr. Elizabeth Blackburn and her new company, Telemi Health, has come up with that can tell whether a person has short telomeres if relative to their age and other conditions that might suggest one of these disease processes. Is there a way we can jump in here with preventive measures that are lower cost? And then at the same time, I'd be looking over here at the yoga therapy research that has shown that every single one of these diseases that I listed here, the heart disease, diabetes, cancer, chronic stress, big, big uh, uh, effect, PTSD, the post-traumatic stress disorder, all of these, when you apply the yoga therapy, the science is showing that it gives improvement and sometimes reverses. Not only that, there's even been a study that showed that the yoga intervention, and the yoga intervention, just to qualify this, usually is has some or, or strong component of meditation, which by the way, Dr. Elizabeth Blackburn is now a meditator. She's very interested in the effect of meditation on the brain. So bringing it back here, what if I was that insurance company, I'd connect the dots and say, hey, it's a lot less expensive to hire a well-qualified, well-trained yoga therapist to treat these people and give them the lifestyle direction that they need because the science tells us that exercise, nutritious diet, losing excess weight, lowering emotional stress, big one that yoga is really effective with, all of these things that yoga therapists can do as well as give the techniques and the support to make these changes to deal with stress, to deal with the excess weight, and so forth. It would be so much less expensive than what the insurance companies are having to shell out right now for you know, heart disease and diabetes, cancers. I mean, they are just epidemic in our country. So if we could get a method that would cost less, that would be, I think, really interesting if we get the insurance companies saying, hey, let's do an intervention that's not gonna have all the side effects that all many of these strong drugs have, that the operations, uh, the risk of, of the operations can have. Let's, let's look at this and let's save some money and save some lives. I mean, to me, it's a no-brainer.